they put a bomb in the mailbox. Church is supposed to be a peaceful place, but that peace was shattered at two Las Cruces churches after explosive devices went off. The first was at Calvary Baptist after a blast in a mailbox near the church. Half an hour later, another explosion, this time in a trash can outside Holy Cross Catholic Church. I took the bread in my hands and I was saying, take and eat. This is my, and I was bending over saying, this is my body when this large bang went off. No one was hurt, but investigators want to know who did it and why. Local, state, and federal agencies are all looking into what type of explosives were used and if these incidents are connected. Governor Susana Martinez returned to Las Cruces, where she once worked as a district attorney and had strong words for whoever did this. Only a coward would place an explosive device in a place of peace and a place of worship. The news had people all over New Mexico on edge. So much so, officials at Calvary Albuquerque Church ordered everyone out after a suspicious package showed up at the church bookstore. The reason that they believed it to be suspicious is uh, they've never had a package to their knowledge that's been delivered on a Sunday. APD officers and bomb squad members showed up fast and figured out the box was just a box filled with books. But with the blasts in southern New Mexico fresh on everyone's minds, APD says the church did the right thing. They didn't want to waste anybody's time, but at the same time, um, after telling them that, you know, what happened this morning, every precaution needs to be taken. And that's exactly what's happening in Las Cruces, where other churches are on alert as police look for suspects. So far, authorities in Las Cruces say they haven't found anything that leads them to believe this was a hate crime, but they are still investigating. Meanwhile, the FBI has also set up a hotline for anyone with information about suspects to call. It's 1-800-CALL-FBI. Back to you.